You grabbed it, you gotta get it. We got the goods. I have the bag and I'm ready to get started. This will be interesting. All right, we just made it to Dollar Tree. The way this challenge is going to work is I'm gonna go into this store, put a blindfold on, and my mom's going to guide me. So say I need to pick out eyeshadow. I'm gonna put my blindfold on and then blindly pick an eyeshadow and then I have to use that to get ready. Let's do it. We got the goods. Spent $10.70. That was a quick, easy, and cheap trip. Now I'm ready to get myself all dolled up. I am back home now. It is a different day, I'm not gonna lie to you. I waited a little bit to film this video after I got all the supplies, but I have the bag and I'm ready to get started. I am going to start with nails. So let's see what I got. Nail polish, all these this beautiful all colors. colors. Yeah, everything in front of you. Well, that's okay. You need something to go with it, trust me. Okay, what does that mean? Well, you'll find out later. This is what I chose. I chose a clear nail polish. That's not gonna work, it's a top coat. So I needed a color. Oh yeah, up top, there you go. That's exactly what you need. Perfect, there you go. And I got this, this bright blue. I gotta go paint them. First I have to do the blue. Is there a method to this? Oh, I don't know. Oh. My goodness. What is that? Editing Lydia here. I want to talk about this nail polish. In the video, I think I'm over exaggerating. Nail polish from Dollar Tree is good. I would use their product again, but I would not pick that color. There you go. I don't think I can mess this up, so that's good. Done. They need to dry. They need to dry. They're so bright. Okay, I think they're pretty dry and I'm gonna start with makeup now. <laughs> what did I get for face makeup? The first thing that I chose at Dollar Tree was foundation. To the right, just a hair. Up. Now go. <laughs> That's it. <laughs> this is LA Colors Liquid Makeup. It's in the color tan. Look at me. I'm not tan. Oh. oh, that is so dark. Oh my goodness. That is not gonna work for my skin tone. Oh no. <laughs> it looks like I'm applying self tanner. It's drying and it's not blending. It needs to blend. Oh, I got it in my eyebrows. Oh, I honestly think I need more just to blend it. Look at my neck. Can y'all see that? <laughs> Look at this. Oh, it's drying so I can't do anything. I think I just need to stop. On the bright side, it makes my teeth look whiter. <laughs> okay, I didn't get any concealer, I didn't get any powder, but I got blush because obviously I need to add some more color to my face. I absolutely 100% resemble an Oompa Loompa. That is what I look like. There's some blush. Yeah. Would you like blush? Yeah. To the right, just a hair. Now straight ahead, straight ahead. You got it. Oh, kinda, yeah, right there. You got it. Yay. Powder blush in pink blush. This is a good choice. Good, good job blindfolded, Lydia. Oh, it comes with its own brush. Okay, I see you LA Colors giving me everything I need. Oh my goodness, this brings me back to childhood days when I play with little kid makeup. <gasps> Look how cute it is, so tiny. Going to get some circle motion and, oh, it's my eyes and up. It just made a mark, that's it. I was gonna try to make this look good until I realized I'm gonna look like an Oompa Loompa. I'm gonna use my own blush brush. <laughs> oh my goodness. Let's just move on. What's next? Eyeshadow. Where's the eyeshadow? Straight in front of you. There's one right there. 
This is the eyeshadow that I picked out. This is in the color Lucky. Once again, it's LA Colors. Of course, it comes with its own brush. <laughs> the eyeshadow is in shades of green, teal, white, and brown. Why? I think I'm going to use this middle shade that's a teal. Okay, that's not terrible. I don't think I'm getting enough off of this brush, so I'm gonna use my own. I actually look like a clown. And I am afraid of clowns. I decided to zoom in so you could see more of this scary face. I'm gonna take this white shade that's in the palette, put it in the middle. I have heard that this does brighten up your eyes, but I don't think I need any more help standing out. I'm gonna take this darker brown right here and use it as a crease color. I don't know if this is gonna do anything. It's worth a shot. Oh yeah, I did something. Okay, now I'm using a blending brush to blend all the greens and browns together. Next is eyeliner. Oh, we need some good eyeliner, I think. Straight ahead, just stick your hand out. To the right now, please, ma'am. To the right, to the right, to the right. There, right there. Right there, you got one. <laughs> Let's do this. This is actually a really good eyeliner. That's not too bad. I am highly impressed. I'm gonna use this again. I only use eyeliner when I'm in a show though, so maybe four times a year. Mascara. I accidentally touched this when I was trying to reach for something else. And now you're in the mascara and eyeliner now. Go straight ahead. That's not what you want. Oh, I touched it. <laughs> so that's mascara. Oh my goodness, this is so tiny. I love tiny things. It's so tiny. Oh yeah, the classic wand. Oh yeah. It's effective though. I actually like this. I think this is doing a good job. It's not clumping at all. I love mascara face. This is actually really good. I am very impressed with this mascara. Lastly, I'm gonna use this lipstick that I accidentally touched in the very beginning. Okay. And the next thing over, you can try reaching for, no, the next one over. Go back to where you were. Wait, I grabbed it. You grabbed it, you gotta get it. Okay, That's I lipstick, sweetie. Touching. The shade is cult. What? Coral Sheen. I only wear chapstick. So this is gonna be interesting because I don't like lipstick at all. It smells good. It smells like vanilla. That's not terrible. Here's the finished makeup look. My face does not match my neck. That is insane. Lastly, hair. We're back at it. It is hair accessory time. All right, let's see what we can find. You wanna go down? Okay, go down. Um. I first touched this elastic package. Then my mother, <laughs> my mom, she was a little tricky with me is what I want to say. I thought she was leading me to the area that hair accessories were in, but she was actually leading me right to the headband she wanted me to pick. To the right, straight down. Hey, to the right. Wait, Lib, listen. Straight, straight. There you go, perfect. Just what you need. You're gonna love this one. It was this headband. So somehow I have to create a look with multiple hair bands and a headband. I think I'm gonna do side fishtail braids. I think those would look pretty with the headband. I made a video all about how to fishtail. So if you wanna see that, click the eye up here. At the end of this, I feel like I'm going to look like a young child that got into their mother's makeup. I'm going to add this beautiful pink elastic. I actually do like this elastic. Now on to the second fishtail. moment of truth. Oh, no. I need to make it a little looser so it looks like I'm not six. I am much older than six in real life. Maybe if I pull pieces out up at the front, it'll make it look better. I'm not mad at this. I'm definitely mad at my makeup, but I'm not mad at my hair. Do I look like a young child? Yes. Does my makeup look bad? Yes. Am I mad with the whole look? No. This was a super fun challenge. I think y'all should try it too. And 
That leads me into devotion time. Let's talk about the Lord. 1 Peter 5, 7 says, cast all your anxiety on him because he cares for you. Some people are going back to work now. Some of us are going back to school. And I think this can cause a lot of anxiety and stress. This Bible verse reminds me to push all my fears away because the Lord can handle it all. And so trust in that today. Feel free to subscribe to my channel down below and hit the notification bell. That just alerts you whenever I post a video so you can click on it and watch it. I hope y'all have a great rest of your day. Be a blessing to others today. Bye guys.